How is ATP generation in mitochondria and chloroplasts similar? In unit three, we've talked about these two great metabolic reactions, photosynthesis and the electron transport chain of cellular respiration. And there are deep similarities to the way that they work. And this kind of cross-topic thinking is essential to your success in the AP Bio exam. Both of these processes use an electron transport chain to pump protons to an enclosed space, creating a proton gradient. And in photosynthesis, Here's the electron transport chain. We're pumping protons from the stroma to the thylakoid space. In cellular respiration, we're pumping protons from the matrix to the intermembrane space. And both use a subsequent process of chemiosmosis, the fusion of protons through an ATP synthase channel to generate ATP. And that's not a coincidence. As we'll see in unit seven, where we'll talk about evolution, the similarities that are present between mitochondria and chloroplasts indicate that at some point in very ancient history, they had a common ancestor. ATP synthase evolved once, and then it became shared by the ancestors of chloroplasts and mitochondria. It's an incredible ride seeing biology and seeing evolution in process. Want to learn more? Sign up for a free trial of the website that guarantees your AP Biology success, learn-biology.com, and watch this next video.